Well, here we are now at the Maltings in Farnham, Emma, and uh, I'm imagining you're about an hour away from going on stage. Yep. Can you just sort of tell me how you're feeling? Really excited. I think the nerves kick in probably about ten minutes before. So at the moment I'm excited and I'm focusing on channeling all that excitable energy into um, kind of the performance itself and um, I've just actually been told that it's completely sold out now which is brilliant. amazing. And can you tell me from the point of view of the venue, is yes. it reassuring to be sort of familiar acoustically with how it will deliver? But because I've played mm. here before, um, I kind of knew what to expect and this Nathan is a friend of mine, he's doing sound for us today so no it's wonderful. You're here, you're prepping, you're getting ready to go on okay. and I'm imagining you've got a sort of fairly well oiled routine of what you do when you do when yes. you do it. Yes. Can you give us a little insight <laughs> into what that is? It probably, well I usually you know, try and eat um, a couple of hours before the performance. There's always the fear of if you eat just before you go on stage something awful is going to happen on the microphone. <laughs> I spend, I try and spend half an hour, 20 minutes, half an hour, just really warming up. Um, it's not that I'm a big belty singer or anything, it's just that um, to keep your voice conditioned and to, you know, for longevity, I suppose it's very important. So when your little foot touches that stage, can you describe sort of deep within you, when your soul feels, when you actually, yeah. this is what I'm here to do, yeah. I'm now going to do it. Absolutely. That's kind of like the pivotal moment for me. It's, it's, it's really scary, but this, this feeling comes over me where I just, I know that I belong there mm -hmm. and I know that I'm about to deliver my songs that are from my heart and it's, it's the most incredible feeling. It's, there's a buzz, you know, there's um, mm -hmm. excite, excitement. Um, there's yeah. an element of um, um, just, bec I can become quite emotional as well. I've been very lucky with the audience as I've had so far. I haven't mm -hmm. had, any, had any rotten tomatoes thrown at me yet. No. So. <laughs> you can't anticipate reaction and so no. that must be very exciting. Um, I had mm. one gig um, recently, the first time I played up in Scotland, <gasps> and I, I performed, I went straight out onto the stage and started with A Place Called You, which is a song that's been playlisted across the country. Absolutely. And, um, and these two men were standing in front of me, singing the song back to me louder than I was singing it, and it was the most <sighs> incredible feeling, and just the cheers and the, you know, the fact that people knew my music, it was an oh. incredible feeling, so... Well, yeah. more than you will imagine we'll know as this progress, <laughs> but um, just have a great gig and perhaps we'll Thank chat you. with you and see how it's gone. Absolutely. This is our final Girls and Guitars uh, for 2013. It's my final Girls and Guitars as well. Uh, this is the biggest audience we've had for Girls and Guitars and it gives me a huge thrill to introduce Emma Stevens and her legendary, this is here, guitarist Sam. What an amazing welcome, thank you so much, and thank you so much Chris, this is great to be back here, and I can't believe it's almost doubled since last time, so this is, this is really amazing. Anyway, we're going to start with a song called A Place Called You. Long ago and far away.
this was a test to see if you could let me kind of get away with playing banjo, but I'm bad. Thank you. <laughs> And so weak. All your worries are turning to ghosts that watch you sweat, but won't let you sleep. The winter seems longer this year, so dark and so cold. The flowers you planted are gone, but away the spring will watch them grow. How are you feeling? It was a wonderful reception. Oh my reception. goodness! It was the, like oh, I'm like buzzing. It was amazing. I just the fact that I got like two encores was like oh my goodness, incredible feeling. And just I don't know, everyone was so happy and just seemed to like what we were doing. And it was just amazing. I loved it. You've covered so many different emotions in the course mm. of it. What does it take out of you? I mean, do you actually find I the will adrenaline be... will hold you up for a while? No, no. Probably in about half an hour, I'll be exhausted. Um, just because. Um, the feeling on stage, I, I put in so much of my soul and, and um, for me the most important thing is getting the emotion across in my the mm. adrenaline of coming off stage can only last so long and then it's literally like Gosh, that's mm. why uh, touring is so tiring. You, I completely <laughs> understand it. And the thing is, it's a unique experience. Mm. It's not like cinema mm. when repeat, repeat. Mm. This is every evening is yeah. different for you and that yeah. makes it truly special. Yeah. So if those people go away tonight with something special, what they. is the message that you like to think they've taken away? Because you've given your soul tonight and yeah. that's very special. Um, I just hope they go away thinking, feeling touched by the messages in the songs, but also that they enjoy seeing me perform and seeing how much I enjoy it. Some of the lyrics, I, I feel like it's really important, especially the younger children, but they don't think that they need to go out in a leotard and like massive high heels to be, you know, cool. I, I want to be a good role model to younger Which children and, and I hope that, you know, they can see that through my lyrics and through what I'm doing. Well, it's an entirely beautiful thing to watch you. It's just oh, incredible you. energy and uh, I think you touch many hearts out oh, there tonight. Thank so, you so much, hearty thank congratulations you. to you. Thank and you very uh, much. I think uh, they're calling you. So, uh, thank you so much for your time. <laughs> it's a pleasure. Thank you so thank much. You. Thanks. Right, I'm going to leg it to the merch. <laughs> thank you so much. The night brighter than the moon I couldn't stop it if we wanted to Tell me I'm not dreaming Uh-oh, I'm out of my depth Struggling to breathe, gotta catch my breath A little voice saying yes, yes, yes I can hear the siren screaming When you touch me Got love is riptide. 